Let's move now live to Homestead. CBS 4's Aradia Ortega is there with details. Aradia. Rudabay and Elliot, according to CBS News, U.S. officials say that as of tonight, almost all children who have been separated from their families at the border will be reunited. Meantime, Senator Marco Rubio toured this facility here in Homestead and spoke with reporters afterwards. It's very sad. It's a terrible situation. Obviously, you never want to see anybody in these circumstances. Florida Senator Marco Rubio speaks with the media following his tour of the homestead facility that houses migrant children. He noted the facility is operating under some very challenging circumstances. I'm trying to do the best they can and, uh, from the brief time that we were there. And, uh, and obviously, we, we need to ensure that irrespective of how someone came here or what legal status they're under, we're the United States of America and we should have the highest standards possible uh, in terms of how we're treating people. Hecklers interrupted Senator Rubio several times during the news conference. This is unfair. You're an opportunistic. That's what you're being here. Fresh from his trip along the border in Tornillo, Texas, with the United States Conference of Mayors, City of Miami Mayor Francis Suarez spoke about his concern about not being able to tour the facility there. We're not allowed access, which, of course, creates uh, suspicion. I mean, why, why not allow a bipartisan group of mayors in? Uh, and we just wanted to see what condition were the kids in and what, if any, plan there is to reunite them with their families, how long it's going to take. Tuesday, Senator Bill Nelson and Congresswoman Debbie Wasserman Schultz were denied access to the Homestead facility. The next day, the Department of Health and Human Services released video they say showed the conditions inside. Mayor Suarez says he wants transparency. He's gained unfettered access to all these facilities, to independent organizations, the media, uh, bipartisan organizations like the Conference of Mayors, so that they can uh, be uh, uh, ensured and tell the public that these kids are being well taken care of. Representatives Debbie Wasserman Schultz and Frederico Wilson, along with Senator Bill Nelson, are scheduled to tour this facility tomorrow. There's also a protest expected to take place with a march starting at a nearby Walmart. Live in Homestead, Aurelia Ortega, CBS 4 News at 7.